Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. So today I found a nice little nugget on the internet. Breezy happened to live stream from the Airbnb that she moved into for garlic bread. And it was before everything was revealed. We didn't know she was dating garlic bread, right? So the reason she gave for moving of course, put her in the victim role, of course, had to do with her kid. Um, so we'll go ahead and take a look at what she was saying before everything was revealed, and then how the story changed after everything was revealed. Just as you guys know, I moved um, where I was living. I was living there for seven years, and it just became a place that wasn't like safe for me anymore. Um, and when you have a child, safety is number one. It just, it came to the point where it was time to move. So that's the thing that gets me confused is the part with the um, uh, Airbnb conversation okay. that I think uh, Ryan Moody said that you got an Airbnb close to his home or you no, rented out an Airbnb. No. How did that work? Long Beach. I, I, so he... See, this is what makes me mad because he made it seem like I was just this person obsessed with him. But like he had me believing we were going to buy a house. To he had me believing that I was going to move from the place I was at because I had a male roommate. And so and that situation wasn't the best. So I needed to move anyways. But he had me convinced to go stay at an Airbnb, like hurry up and get into an Airbnb because I'm going to fly out there and we're going to be looking at houses to buy. Um, You got the airbnb because he told you hey i need you to move out now he accuses that you were living in with the live-in boyfriend and while he was sending you food he was the live-in boyfriend his name is luis i believe his name is juan but no okay okay, oh, okay. Uh, so and I that was your living boyfriend and you guys were you were kind of like um playing him like you were kind of like with him and then you were with ryan moody at the same time no so i had a relationship with that person over a year ago and we had ended things but we also had a place like together so moving out was just kind of like okay we're separated but we're roommates and we had we had been broken up for like a year before i even started talking to ryan which he knows that is is that the reason why ryan moody wanted to like um move have you move away from your uh current home at the time do you think it was because of jealousy like he was thinking like maybe you were hooking up with um well, see, we had a conversation shortly before I moved to the Airbnb where he was like, you know, I'm kind of worried about our future together. And I was like, why? He's like, you still live with a man, like a man. And he like for the next few days made my life to the point, I'm going to say it was hell. And like, I remember looking on my computer day and night trying to find affordable Airbnbs for me and my daughter, like, and my dog. <laughs> yeah. So it was like a big deal. You were saying, you live with another man. And I'm like, our relationship's been done and over. It was the place where we had this place. And I didn't really care as long as he didn't bother me. He could, you know. <laughs> what do you guys think? I think that is a shifty ass story that changed really quickly. Um, all of a sudden, by the end of that Yo Mama interview, you know, she didn't have a problem living with that guy as long as he didn't bother her. So it seems really strange, but here's some more clips from the Airbnb to take us out. Enjoy. See you guys in the next video. Something's been going on in my personal life, so you could probably tell I've been sounding a little down. Um, but I'm okay. I'm going to heal. I'm going to get through it. I think I just need to get situated a little bit more. Like so much happened at once, then I needed to move, and now I'm here. So, um, yeah, I think I just, once things settle down and I heal from whatever I'm going through, which is going to be an ordeal in itself, because, like, I still don't have closure leaving my old place and everything that happened, and then, I don't know. So I'm going to have to look through boxes, find it, and then um, I will find a place where I feel comfortable painting. Moving is very stressful. It is. It is. There was a lot that happened, and... <clears throat> A lot like I kept in and it just got to the point like I said like it wasn't healthy for anybody to be living there anymore at least not me and my daughter so we left um, and I couldn't be happier living in Long Beach I, I 
I'm sad going through my own stuff, but like I let me pretend I care. Okay, I'm done. I think stress plays a part in it too. I don't think I've ever felt the level of stress that I felt lately. So that I think that might be playing a part. Your profile picture scares me. Okay, well, you don't have to look at it. See what's going on with Foodie. Michelle, we missed you too. I love scary movies too. I love them. Chachi's a girl, but she likes to wear a jersey sometimes. And she could be a bit of a tomboy. <laughs> I love scary Yeah, I love scary I think we should do it. I need to figure out how to set up a Twitch. So then maybe that's just could be like our thing. Maybe like, I don't know, once a month to start. Like we'll just get together and watch a movie or something. Hi, Green Eyed Girl. What's your favorite scary movie? You know what? Well, scary movie is one of them. Uh, I like everything. I don't know. Like, I'm not one of those people who have, like, necessarily, like, oh, I only like this. Like, I love so many. Like, the scarier, the better. Obviously, like, Texas Chainsaw, any Freddy movie. Um. Busy Little B, I will have to congratulate you and thank you on this coverage of the story that nobody ever wants to hear. That's about Breezy, uh, breezy and uh, Garlic Bread. I am all over anytime you drop some content. It's a nice lady called Busy Little B. It's a, a nice channel. Busy Little B. Subscribe. That is Queen B. Busy Little B. Subscribe to Busy Little B's channel. Well, Busy Little B. Good night, Busy Little B.